Greetings YouTube, it's your boy Freelancer Joe here with a session of gaming with Joe. So let's get cracking. <laughs> uh, I'm so stupid. <clears throat> but in a fun way, because I'm just being stupid and affecting myself and anyone unfortunate enough to listen to me, but I'm not actually impacting anybody's lives against their will. I don't think, although it's entirely possible in the future, once Google takes over everything, they force people to watch YouTube videos. Hard to say. Uh, yeah, so after a long week of work and freelancing and training, I guess it's time to have some fun and relax. Well, I suppose relax is probably the better term because still all I got is Destiny 2. And yeah, fun. Or more accurately, I suppose how I have fun and how Destiny is set up is pretty much at odds with each other. Probably gonna be reverbing. Oh well, whatever. Highly doubtful anybody's watching anyway. Yeah. It's been a productive week. I've already done pretty much all of my chores for the day. I've been grocery shopping. Laundry's being done right now. Vacuums in the bathroom, in the floors. Uh, yeah, other than the laundry and cleaning the kitchen counters, I pretty much did all that. I attempted to do my training this morning. Only the second time I've ever failed at completing my target objectives for training. I failed in many other ways. Usually I end up hurting myself before I reach failure, which I guess is technically failure, but... <sighs> I was on the third set of the deadlift, got a quarter of our way off the ground, and gravity said, Nah, son, this is mine. <laughs> and my muscle said, Okay, it's all yours. And actually, the only other time I've failed like that is on deadlift too. I forget what I was doing. I mean, it was deadlift. That sort of thing sears itself into your memory. Ah, the trials of the nine. The epitome of what I don't like. PvP. And looking at the milestones. Iron Banner. Another PvP I don't like. Raid, Raid Lair, Nope, Nightfall, Need McLean, Called Arms, again PvP, Nope, Trials of the Nine, Nope, Heroic Strikes, Yay, difficult missions with modifiers that make it more difficult, paired with randos, Nope, Source of, of Heroes, Nope, the two things I can do are Actually, all right, technically, I could do Nightfall. Well, I could try to do Nightfall. I could try to do Iron Banner. Call the Arms and Heroic Strikes. As I said, Iron Banner, Crucible. I can't do Trials of Night. Ugh. Really, the only two Wiggly Milestones I can do. I did do for all three of my characters. So that just leaves one thing I'm still working on. These things. On the plus side, I only have one more to do. On the downside, that means one of, what, 44, I guess? Uh, one in 45 chance in theory, except I've been getting duplicates for a while, so. Let's see if I can squeeze in here. 
Yeah, once that's done. It's like, oh, well, you can keep doing the power ground for the things you can do. It's like, yeah, but once Forsaken drops, I mean, what's the point? Yeah, you can grind, or you can just wait until Forsaken. The first piece of gear you get will just slingshot you up. Well, maybe it won't. I mean... I don't know. I just think that I've been grinding every week, and that I bet you after Forsaken drops within... Two to three night sessions with my buddies, they'd catch up, even though they've only been on like twice this entire season. So, oh, well, you know, just join a clan. Yeah, brah. Uh, am I in here in time? Is anybody else in here? Nobody's tripping it. There's some strange topography in that sector. Let's try to map it with a scan. Hopefully next time I'll remember to turn off the volume on my laptop. And I guess I could move the microphone. Yeah. These are the brakes. Novel idea. So, since in Forsaken, maps would be much more valuable. Now, actually, going out of my way to stop and pick up maps. Yeah. Who's shooting? Are you still shooting at me? So now I got the two guys. Scan sealed and delivered. Seriously. I could really use more information on the neural. Seriously. Will you scan for me? Oh wait, it's level two? If I'd known it was level two, I'd have stuck around. At least two, at least two a try.
shot.
Seems unlikely. <sighs> Never enough power. I take that back though. I did wander into the level 6 wave. Unfortunately, nobody else was there. I don't know how the hell they got it to level 6. I actually would have liked to have seen it. The highest I've ever got. Cleared level 2 twice, and I saw cleared 1 level 3. That's it. So they ain't kidding the one that's let me say it's designed for high level inductivity for a team. This is good data. Anna will be pleased. Bother nobody just sweeping my corner. Bastards coming from. the high level Give me uh, one thing I'm looking for. Rasputin was watching. Yeah, do I have enough? Yeah, just enough for one. <clears throat> one so you can see that I won't get it. Oh well. Yeah. You know, uh, mine lab. Well, 
Yeah, might as well. So they say, they being, uh, you know, them, that uh, where you are affects location of the nodes that you unlock. I think that's correct, but I think what they really miss is whatever the seed value is for the RNG. So depending on what the seed value is, and that's going to affect which areas have higher probabilities. Unfortunately, that just means trying to find the pattern. Or ideally, you stock up on a whole lot of those stems. And then, you try and find the location that's generating the most for the one that you want. Ideally, but what ails? See, I believe it or not, the dynamo is one that I'm still missing, but not for the poor catwalk. No, it's actually dynamo approach that I'm missing. <laughs> Only three there. One I got real early. The second one I only got fairly recently, and this last one still just bugging me. Oh, this is one guy. This guy's nuts. Here's something to fight back the hive. We can't let the hive claim this war sack. Careful out there, Guardian. That's nice. Just considering how crap I am. I am. Look at this. Come on. We'll take care of it.
Better run. Let's see, is there anything else to get? I could go retrieve that stone. Alright, I'm getting this. Then I'm out of here. Yeah. It doesn't sound like gaming with Joe had a lot of fun. And truth be told, I really didn't. <laughs> I could have bought. Uh, I could have bothered playing through the uh, Mars missions from other characters. But again, what's the point? They cap the gear level. So yeah, whatever. lesson here is when you're doing game design, it's probably not the best thing to try and control. You want to create a sandbox and let your players run wild. But you try and control things. What happens if the systems you set up, players don't enjoy? What happens if they run out of things that they can do? Well then you get sessions like this. Sessions that suck. I'm being negative. At least, I mean, I got those, so that's kind of nice. So I'm trying to be positive here, folks. And I got some of those, and I got a duplicate, so, I mean, yeah, okay. Eh, well, you know, at least it was a nice distraction. And, you know, there's always comparisons. It's like, okay, well, compared to this, cleaning the rest of my kitchen counters might be fun. Anyway, uh, so I'm going to wrap this up now. Uh, thanks for watching and being as entertained as I was while playing this. Um, tomorrow will be drinks with Joe, which will be more babbling, but no visual distraction of the game. So, you know, join me if you will. Um, likes, uh, no, wait, 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 what did the cool kids say? Oh, yeah, if you have any comments or suggestions, please leave them in the comment box below. If you like, please hit like and subscribe if you want to see more. Um, and until next time, take care and God bless.